Hey guys, Monday, October the 1st, 2012. Uh, oh god, my dog's gonna bark. This is gonna be a one-taker. You know that kind of video where if I leave a dog barking in, it's probably a one-taker. Anyway, uh, sorry that this is gonna be a one-taker. I just tried to make a video before I left for school today, and uh, I, it turned out being like seven minutes, and I'm like, no, I need to condense my thoughts into five. So this is my attempt at that. Um, it's October. First, and that means it's October, which means there are a lot of things happening in October. Um, good things, namely today being the weather. October 1st, good thing, weather. I mean, it's just gorgeous outside. It's like it's not cold enough to need like a hoodie, but still, I mean, it's just nice to be outside today. You're not sweating your butt off, so that's something to look forward to. Better weather, maybe, hopefully, in the upcoming days. I'll, I can, I'm a fan of that. Um, but yeah, I mean, there's Halloween, of course. I gotta figure out what I'm wearing as a costume because I know there's a Halloween party coming up soon, and I'm just not prepared because I don't know what I'm gonna what I'm gonna be. So we'll figure that out. But um, yeah, and then there's there's Voodoo Fest, of course. I'll leave a link in the doobly-doo for the Voodoo Fest lineup. Um, hopefully I'm going, and hopefully I will see some of you there. Maybe that'd be cool. Um, yeah, I'm really excited because I, I mean, of course there's Green Day, the, the big band Green Day playing. Um, but also, to be completely honest with you guys, Say Anything is playing on Friday, I think, and I saw Max Bemis, you know, solo, but I've, I've never seen Say Anything as a full band, so I'm really excited because they are my favorite band. Um, so yeah, that's something to look forward to. Um, my school is putting on Rocky Horror Picture Show, not the movie, an actual play, an outdoor play, which is kind of crazy, actually. Um, they're building a set, like, in the middle of our courtyard, I guess you could say, like in the middle of the school, and uh, it's, it looks, I, I, I'm guessing it's supposed to be Frank's Laboratory, but I'm not entirely sure, but from what I can gather, I think it's just Frank's Laboratory, so I don't know how that's going to work out as far as the entire play goes, but I'm really excited, I'm definitely going to see it, um, I, I'm, I think it's ten bucks, you bring a blanket, and if that blanket can fit everyone in your party, it's only ten dollars, so that's a steal, instead of paying per person, you just pay like ten dollars or I think it's five or something like that if you bring a lawn chair I don't know I'll figure that out and let you guys know as soon as possible if you're interested um uh, what else what else what else okay uh last thing or no okay never mind we'll do that last Doctor Who I've been uh I've watched all of David Tennant's Doctor Who episodes uh so that means I've got up to I'm on series five right now um David Tennant was the man um, oh man, he's so good. His final episode, which is called The End of Time, uh, just the last, like, 20 minutes of that episode, it's just feel a palooza. Like, there's just so many things happening in that episode, and David Tennant's acting is, 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 is so good, like, top-notch. It's just unbelievable. Um, uh, every, every moment leading up to his regeneration... Oh, God, don't bark. Stop! Every moment leading up to his regeneration into Eleven, who is portrayed by Matt Smith. Beautiful, beautiful acting. So, I'm really excited to start Matt Smith. And if you've got the time, which is, it's, takes a lot of time to get into, Doctor Who is a good show. Um, and lastly, we're going to talk about... Borderlands, just kidding, this is the first one. The first one is $30 at Best Buy with three of the DLCs, three out of four DLCs. Definitely worth picking up and getting into. But we're going to talk about Borderlands 2 in this last minute. I finished it last night at about 2 in the morning, and it was definitely worth it. It's so much fun. The writing is beautiful. The characters are funny. There's a lot of moments that make you, like, side-splitting laughter. And there are moments that make you sadder than anything. It's it's such an improvement over the first. And that's, that's, that's not saying... I don't know if that's saying a lot or not saying enough. It's beautiful. Everything about this game is good, and I mean there are minor bugs that I have problems with, but other than that, great game. You got your four classes here. I'm not even gonna name them, but uh, yeah, that's it. Borderlands 2, great game. 4.5 out of 5. That's what I'm gonna give it. Maybe 5 out of 5. Screw it. We'll do it live. All right, last 30 seconds. <gasps> James and Kaylin, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, everybody else, have a great week. Uh, happy October. Happy, 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 happy October. Uh, as always, don't forget to be awesome. I'm Christian Babin. I will see you guys next week. Bye!